Hey guys, I just want to do a really quick video here on the reverse actuator motor. Um, mine went out, which was the original one. This is a 2012 F1100. So I did see online that you could buy one from AutoZone, and I did. And there it is right there is the number 742-115. I will tell you, the... Looking down at it now, everything is in the right place, but when it comes, it's going to be like that with the plug on this side. So you have to take out those four screws and pull the whole assembly out. When I mean pull the whole assembly out, pull this piece right here where the plug goes in, pull it and this you know box right here that has the magnet in it, pull that all that out as one unit, turn it around 180 degrees, and push it back down inside so then it removed it over to here instead of it being over there so now once I did that and I installed it um, I did do some research and it said that the polarity might be wrong well yeah of course the polarity was wrong on mine so then what I had to do because every time I started it it would be in reverse so what I ended up having to do is you take this clip off and then you stick a bobby pin or something in there to release those wires, um, the connections, and pull them out and just switch them around and then put everything back together and bolt it back down. Um, it says 36 foot-pounds with blue Loctite. I wouldn't go 36 foot-pounds with this aftermarket. Um, it's a window actuator but we're using it as a reverse actuator I wouldn't I would not go 36 foot pounds I started getting close to 30 and boy she sure looked like a, it even felt like it was gonna snap so I stopped before 36 you do whatever you want um, I just a little quick tip here uh, have fun and stay safe